We have some of the coolest superhero weapons and tools coming up for your faces today. We have everything from Iron Man pickaxes, to Spider-Man pickaxes, to one final super secret pickaxe, which you're going to have to watch all the way to the end to find out exactly what that is. Shh. Make sure you go ahead and leave a comment down below to let me know which one of these awesome pickaxes was your favorite. And quickly, make sure you go ahead and leave a like in 3, 2, 1, now, or I will find your house and mine down all your walls. Hey! It's time for the adventure to begin. After weeks and weeks of searching, Guido, we have finally found it. The Avengers Tower. This is the headquarters of the bravest and most noble group of warriors in the entire multiverse, the Avengers. A group of extraordinary individuals. I wonder if they'd let me join. Oh, maybe I could join too, Steve. Actually, Guido, they don't really have a good history with robots. Remember Ultron? Oh, I've got to say, I'm a whole lot more nervous than I really thought I'd be. I mean, this morning, I woke up ready. I was ready to go. Ready to go in there and meet the Avengers. And now, now I'm a little bit nervous. Hmm, adventurers. Maybe we could solve that. To raise Steve's courage and confidence, make sure you go ahead and hit the like button in three, two, one, now. <sighs> <sighs> Would it kill them to invest in some kind of elevator system? Okay, so here we are. We seem to be on the right floor here. This is the landing area of the Avengers Tower. Whoa, look at this awesome helicopter. Maybe we could take this for a spin later, Guido. Anyway, as I've said, here we are in the landing section, and it looks like we found four levers to the Stark Realm, the Asgard Realm, the Wakanda Realm, and the Spider Realm. What the heck is this? Were the Avengers creating teleporter technology? Wakanda forever! Bam! Whoa, Guido, look at this! We seem to have arrived in Wakanda! And, oh geez, we're not alone! It looks like there are some soldiers right here! Oh, the forces of Wakanda are- Ow! Oh yeah, we got a soldier right here. Let's try to take this guy down from a range. Okay, this guy actually might, might be very tough. There we go. We just obliterated him. Have we got any more? Surely there's not just one soldier, right? Surely that's not a thing. Let's go ahead and make sure we're clearing out this entire area. Maybe it was one soldier. Oh, and look at this. This is what they were protecting. This mysterious ore. Well, let's go ahead and see exactly what it is. Well, it breaks very easily, which is excellent. We have right here... What is this? It's Pantheum. Whoa. Let's go ahead and put this down. Put down two sticks. Go ahead and put three of the Pantheum along the top end. Whoa. The Black Panther pick. Let's go ahead and see exactly what this does. The spirit of the Black Panther protects you. What? I... Oh my gosh, we've got more soldiers over here. Well, let's see if we can talk our way out of this one. Hello, gentlemen. How's it going? Hey, how are you doing, guys? Die! There we go. Oh my gosh, we're just taking them down straight away. And it looks like, while we've got this pick in our hands, they're totally ignoring us. Die! Dude, it is super powerful as well. Let's go ahead and try this out. Let's see if it can mine very quick. Okay, so the sand takes a little bit of time, which is to be expected. But I think... I think as soon as we start getting down to the rocky areas, oh my gosh, wow, it's very fast, look at this, oh my goodness me, oh my gosh, it mines super quickly. Now which one should we go to next, Guido? Wakanda was awesome, but we still have three more left to go. Make sure, adventurers, if you're watching this right now, you leave a comment in the comment section right now telling me which one we should go for. Let's go ahead and see what Tony Stark, Iron Man, has going on. Whoa, dude, look at this. We seem to have been brought to some kind of riverside, I don't know, mansion or something. This is awesome. I, oh, that must be where our next ore is located. Starkium? Oh my goodness. So he must have been developing this ore himself. 
Look at this stuff. It's definitely Iron Man themed. Let's go ahead and take our sticks. Go ahead and take our Starkium. And we have the Iron Man pick. Okay, first things first. Let's go ahead and try out its mining ability. Oh my goodness, wow. It mines so fast. Look at this. Oh my goodness me. Is that even faster than Black Panther? Maybe. Okay, let's go ahead and... Oh. Dude, we are getting so many resources from this. Let's go ahead and see if it has any other capabilities. Um, let me try something like this. Oh my gosh! Dude, we can just vaporize things. Look at this. Iron Man seems to have put his very own systems, his own weapon systems, inside of this pickaxe. Die cows, the number one enemy of Iron Man, that's for sure. Okay, what else can we do here? It looks like we can run really fast and... Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. We can glide with this thing. So this is... Asgard. I've always wanted to visit this place. This is so cool, but it's very cold. Let's go ahead and get down nice and safely here. Ah, oh, that's two broken legs. And let's see what this Thorium, I suppose, is going to have for us. Okay, just mind a little bit of this, a little bit of that. And we have, oh, Asgardium. Cool. So we go ahead and take our crafting table. We take our Asgardium. We take our sticks and we are going to get Thor pick. Are there any mobs around here? Oh, I can see a spider all the way down there. I'm going charging in. Die, spider. Oh my gosh. This thing isn't really powerful at all. What the heck? What gives, Thor? Guido, I... Oh my gosh. Did you hear that? Listen. It looks like we can summon the power of thunder and it seems like that in turn may have just... Um, let's see. Oh my gosh, just upgraded this pickaxe and turned it into a powerful upgraded version of the original tool. Okay, it looks like we've got a nice little dark area over here. We can do a little bit of mining, maybe find some monsters. Oh, it looks like we found another little baby spider here. Bam! Oh my gosh, so it just one-shots monsters now. That is awesome, but we have one more pickaxe left to go. So let's go back to the tower and see what we have. Ooh, this place is fantastic. Guido, look at this. It's like a modern city. Oh, this is so cool. How you doing, Mr. Chicken? I... Oh, it looks like Spider-Man has already been here and he's left us a little present. We have this, which is Spidium. You see this, Mr. Pig? Mr. Pig, look! Spidium! So let's go ahead and mine up as much of this Spidium as we possibly can, just in case, as I've already said, we want to sell it later on. Let's go ahead and bring it back to this crafting table. Two sticks and three Spidium. Spidium, and we should get the Spider-Man pick. Oh, that is a pretty cool design. Now, what exactly are we going to be able to do with this Spider-Man pick? Oh my gosh, it makes us super fast. Look at this. Oh my goodness, I feel so agile. Now that we've got a bunch of concrete around here, we should be able to see if... Oh my gosh, oh yeah, it mines so quickly. Look at these iron bars. They're just... Oh my gosh, they're all gone. This is so rad. We can dig directly under the city. Dude, I just can't believe how fast we can move. Look at this. We can just destroy vehicles, destroy concrete, whatever stands in our way. Dude, this has been, I think you'll agree, an amazing day. Let's go ahead and get back to the Stark Tower and see if there's anything left for us to complete. And there we are, Guido, all four of the superhero Avengers pickaxes in our hands. This is so rad. And look at that. If we quickly go to the Spider-Man pick and then go over to like the Black Panther one, we gain both abilities so it can be super fast and super invulnerable. Whoa, what is this? Do not press? What? Well, you know I've got to go ahead and do exactly that. So let's just push straight through all the... Oh, geez, watch out for that. That's a pretty terrifying hole. Let's go ahead and see what waits for us on the other side here. Don't do it, Steve. It could be dangerous. Nonsense, Guido. If I see a sign that says do not press, you know I've got to go ahead and give it a press. Bam. Oh, oh my gosh. Whoa, dude. Where the heck are we? What's going on here? I... Is that one more pickaxe over there? Oh, dude, we've got to go ahead and check this thing out. Whose could this possibly be? It looks very interesting. It's got a very interesting design. The power of Galactus is not made for mortal hands. What? And whoa, look at all of this power surrounding me. Guido, 
This is pretty insane. I, oh my gosh, well, first of all, we can fly, which is a little bit terrifying considering we could fall very far. All right, let's go ahead and descend downwards nice and gently here and see if we can use this on the, ow, oh, yep, nice and gently, well done. And see if we can use this on the cliffs. Let's see exactly what we can do. Oh, okay, well, okay, first of all, it mines very fast. But as we've already seen, it's not just about how much we can mine, it's also about how much damage we can deal. So let's go ahead and find some spooky monsters and take the fight to them. I really thought there'd be someone in here. It doesn't look like there is. Oh, oh, we've got a zombie with a gun right here. There we go. Okay, we took that guy down straight away. Nothing too much seems to be happening here. We just take people down and... Oh my gosh. Do you hear that? It feels like the power of Galactus is building up and up which could be very dangerous for future adventurers. This dimension could be totally unstable because I... Oh my gosh. What? Which one of those awesome superhero pickaxes was your favorite? Let me know in the comment section down below and make sure you press one of the two videos on the screen right now to go on another adventure with us. See you soon, everyone.